everyone welcome to today's session the topic for today is html block and inline elements so every html has a default display value how it gets displayed depending on what type of element it is like it will come on the new line or it will be on the same line how much space it is taking everything depends on the particular element so now we have two display values that is block and inline we will see each one in the detail first let's look at block level elements so block level elements always start on a new line and the browser automatically adds some space a margin before and after the element basically the thing about block elements is it is going to start on the new line and block element block level element takes up the full width available so consider you are writing some sentence it is going to not just stop there it is going to take the full width available it is it stretches out to the left and right as far it you know as far it is possible so two commonly used block elements are p and div p is the paragraph and d is for division or section in html element so in div uh, p we have seen as a paragraph tag the div is a container which holds the elements which holds or different tags inside it let's look at the code see what we have done is uh, we have written the paragraph tag we have written something inside the div and then we have started something new we will see this code once we execute it on sublime let's look at the other type inline elements now inline elements never start on a new line it the difference between them is a uh, block starts on the new line and inline doesn't start on the new line and block elements they take width of the screen as much it is and inline takes up whatever the text you have written only that much space it is going to take the example of block was p and div the example of inline is span element this is the code for it we are going to look at the sublime code and execute it so let's look at the block elements what i have done is paragraph is written hello world is written inside that border is given why we have given border to understand how the paragraph is working and then the border is given to the div tag also then we have just simply written a paragraph so what were the properties what basically happens with block elements is first thing it is going to take the complete screen space whatever the length it is width i mean then again it is always going to start on the new line so you have to observe if these two things are working with the p and div p and div are the two block elements so we will look at the output and see if that is possible let's go to the google chrome this is block elements you can see when i have written hello world it has taken the full screen space again when we have written here it has taken the full screen space and this new sentence is starting on the new line though we have not written the break tag anywhere so this block elements it's their nature to start on the new line and take up the full width space of the screen that's the thing about block elements and for the span element we have simply written the paragraph and here what we have done is inside the paragraph tag we are using span span element of uh, you use span tag in your angular brackets you write whatever you want to write inside the span and you have to style it it is not mandatory to style it but i have given the border so that we can see how much space it is taking we understand with the border and it is not starting on the new line so what things you have to observe in the output is that it will not start on the new line and it will take the space of whatever text it is written depends on the size let's see the span element you can see hello world is written in the same sentence and after that element is not starting on the new line it is in the same even hello world didn't start on the new line it was in the same sentence then the hello world has taken this much space only though we have given the border it is not taking the full width like the block elements it is taking depending on the words so we learned about block elements and span elements block elements are p and div tag so so what is the thing about them they take the full width space and they always start on the new line with the span element it takes the space depending on the words you write and it never starts on a new line hope it is clear thank you so much